Okay guys, let's have a go at this one then. Question 9, we've got the integral of 4x cubed e to the minus x. Hmm, doesn't look very nice. Looks like we're going to have to do three steps here, doesn't it? Step down, step down, and step down to ground level and put it all together. So we're going to have an i, a j, and a k, it looks like to me. So this would be um, v, won't it? And this is du. So let's draw our grid. Without further ado, and see what happens. So v is 4x cubed. And then du will be e to the minus x. So dv will be 12x squared, won't it? And then the u, integrate that. e to the minus x over minus 1, isn't it? Yeah, when you integrate e to the minus x. So i equals then uv, those two. So those two, it will be 4x cubed e to the, with a minus. So there's minus 4x cubed e to the minus x, yeah? Okay, that's the uv, minus the integral of u dv dx. So it's integral of u minus e to the minus x times 12x squared dx. So let's tidy that up then. It's minus 4x cubed e to the minus x plus 12, can come to the front, x squared e to the minus x, wasn't it? Yeah? dx. There we go. So let's circle that then and label that j. Okay, and now we'll do the j problem here. So draw a line across the page and we're going to call that v. Again, repeat the same process. This will be du. Draw our grid here. So what have we got then? v is equal to x squared and du is equal to e to the minus x. So dv will be 2x, and u will be e to the minus x, and you need the minus underneath, don't you? Okay then, so what have we got then? We've got um, uh, j equals u, v, those two, minus can come to the front, x squared e to the minus x, minus the integral of u dv dx, those two. So it's the integral of 2x, there's a minus there, which I can put with the other minus to make a plus. e to the minus x dx. All right? There's j. Now I need to circle. The 2 can come out to the front, so that's equal to then minus x squared e to the minus x plus 2 lots of the integral of x e to the minus x dx. Now we can circle this. Agreed and call that k. We can finish off. That was the J problem done. Now we need to move to the K problem, which is the integral of x e to the minus x. Yeah. So let's do a ne next page, and we want to do the integral K. Um, K equals the integral of x e to the minus x, wasn't it? Dx. V du. Draw a grid, and we get uh, v is equal to x. Uh, du is equal to e to the minus x, so dv is equal to 1, u is equal to e to the minus x over the minus 1, isn't it? So k equals then u, v, so that's minus can come to the front, x e to the minus x minus the integral of u dv dx, so it's just that minus can come with that minus to make a plus. One times that is just that itself. So we can get the answer here. K is equal to then minus x e to the minus x plus e to the minus x over minus 1, which equals minus x e to the minus x minus e to the minus x. There we go. So there's K done. So that's that problem done. So now we need to combine it all together then. So let's do that. So i equals then minus 4x cubed e to the minus x. So i equals minus 4x cubed e to the minus x. Was now what comes next? Plus 12j. Plus 12j. j was equal to. Um, minus x squared e to the minus x plus 2k. So that's equal to then. So that's 
equal to uh, minus 4x cubed e to the minus x plus 12j and now we need to put j, uh, j in and we had j was um, minus sorry x squared e to the minus x plus 2k minus x squared e to the minus x plus 2k minus x squared e to the minus x plus 2k so that's equal to then minus 4x cubed e to the minus x minus 12x squared yeah e to the minus x then you've got plus 24k and k was this so it's 24 of these and 24 of those so you've got 24k so that would be x e to the minus x with a minus and then minus 24 e to the minus x. So I need to change that to a minus. Remember? We'll check it in a minute. So let's put the minus in there. Yeah, so let's just check that again. i was equal to this, which is there, plus 12j. 12j uh, was put in here. Okay, which was minus x squared e to the minus x. Uh, j minus x squared e to the minus x plus 2k. Agreed? Plus 2k. There it is there. So expand that bracket, you get minus, you get this term here. Then you're going to get plus and minus is a minus 12x squared e to the minus x plus 24k. The 24k, I've done it in one fell swoop, 24 of these would be minus 24x e to the minus x and then minus 24e to the minus x. Now, at long last, we put a k at the end, so I'm going to put it, snick it on here, and a plus k here, and a plus k there. And that's the answer. Okay, then. So that's um, question 9 done. Good. Let's go on to the next one. Great.